always the underdog, never in the spotlight, and nobody's watching. You sure about that? Goosebumps. Murrow College Field Notes, real world lessons from Murrow professors. Hi, I'm Tony Thompson. I'm a professor in the Murrow College of Communication, also produce videos on the side, and here are some field notes on a project we worked on for WSU Athletics, AKA Cougs versus Everybody. So when we sat down with WSU Athletics, they told us that they had a couple different points that they wanted to hit in a video. One, WSU is a national brand and people know about us. Two, we have some iconic sports figures. And three, Cougs are everywhere. And my partner Josue and I were sitting there and our athletic director, Pat Chun, told us, he said, whatever you do, we just want a project that gives you guys goosebumps. And at that point, we looked at each other and said, all right, let's do this. So when we were writing the script, we wanted to start off with something that we know that this is what you think about WSU. So Pullman in the middle of nowhere, what do you guys do out there? Yada, yada, yada. Pullman, where is that? What do you do there? Kick rocks and plow dirt? And then we also wanted to make sure that it was properly paced. Starts off slow, picks up, video does the talking for the rest. And once WSU Athletics appro approved that script, um, we were excited and we knew, all right, we need to find the right voice. For the voiceover, we kept going back and forth. Do we want a former student athlete, a legend uh, speaking for us, or do we try to find somebody from the area? And we thought that it might be a little bit more genuine if we found somebody from the area. And I thought of my friend, Sam Brink. Let me tell you a little something about Washington State. Out here in these fields, we're not just sowing seeds and tilling soil. We're harvesting greatness. For years, I'd told him, yo, I'm gonna use you for a voiceover in some project. I don't know what it's gonna be. This project came up and I said, hey, you ready to do a voiceover? He said, yep, and off we went. One thing that I'm especially proud of is we were editing the video and we had a bunch of clips that we use from WSU Athletics, iconic moments in WSU Athletics history, uh, iconic figures, all that stuff, but we actually reached out on social media and said, hey Cougs, please send us some content of you celebrating at some Coug bars around the country. And we had a number of them come in and we used a lot of them in the video. And seeing people in New York, seeing people in Honolulu, and seeing all these different Cougs all over the country, it proved that point that I talked about earlier, that kooks are everywhere. So that was fun to see and, and use those in the video. It's nice for you to actually produce something that people can see or that people have seen because then they know if they have some ideas, maybe they feel more comfortable asking me for advice in, in that arena. I hope that people can come away from my class thinking that they have a mentor and if they see the content that my partner and I are producing and see that they could do it themselves or that they could go, go in that route and use me as a mentor, that's ultimately what I'm trying to do.